Baseball is a game that Mount Mercy's Kyle Mater has always been around. It was his dad, Tony Mater, who got him involved, and it created a special bond between the two of them. It stayed that way until Tony's death this past April. He was just 51 years old. From as young as I can remember, uh, my dad would take me, I will start in t-ball, he'd take me to the cages, he'd, he'd always be willing to play catch. Um, you know, every time that I said I wanted to, to play, whether it was catch or hit, um, he was always there. And then it kind of just, as I continued on throughout baseball, um, the passion just kind of kept picking up and, and got more competitive. And yeah, even when he was sick, um, he would still be willing. It was kind of tougher, but he'd be willing to do whatever it took to, to make me better as a player. I knew I wanted to finish this season. And one of the reasons I wanted to is because it was for my dad. Um, you know, my dad would always want me to be out here having fun, competing. You know, he's the one that taught me the game of baseball. And there wasn't a minute that I thought I didn't want to, I wanted to step away. I, I wanted to be here. Tony grew up in San Diego, California, played five seasons in the minor leagues, including a couple of seasons with the Cedar Rapids Curdles. He won a Midwest League championship with the Curdles back in 1994. Six years ago, Tony was diagnosed with frontotemporal dementia. For Kyle, it was hard to see his hero suffer through the disease, but baseball helped him through a lot of pain. I think there's a couple different variants. He had the behavioral variant, so um, it kind of affected his behavior. Um, it, it was just, it was kind of tough. Um, he wasn't the same. He would say weird things he never used to say when he was healthy. Uh, baseball is kind of what I like to say my happy place or the place where I feel kind of at peace. I can get away and kind of forget about what's going on. Um, just forget about everything else, all the emotions that kind of set aside, and I can just go play the game I grew up loving. So it, it helped this situation a lot as he continued to get worse. The Mount Mercy baseball team honored Kyle's dad in many ways. Throughout the season, the team wore shirts with the hashtag Team Tony Forever. On senior day, Kyle's grandpa threw out the first pitch with Kyle behind the plate to honor his dad. The team also unveiled a bench right next to the Mount Mercy dugout with Tony's picture and a quote from co-baseball head coach Steve Cook, who was Tony's teammate with the Cedar Rapids Colonels. I got emotional when I first saw it. I had absolutely no clue about it. Um, this was all an initiative that the parents and the and the players uh, took took to do and um, it's just it was just such a blessing seeing that and I mean that bench is I know it's not cheap so that just kind of proves how how amazing the people are here and yeah coach actually pulled me aside and showed me and uh, I think it was the Thursday practice before before we played Clark on Friday so it was just it's just an incredible and it speaks volumes to uh, the people that we have here in this program they're just first class the bench and the shirts uh, those are obviously the big things but they do little things uh, in between that and I think the little things are kind of what helps me even more um, I mean you don't know how many times if I was ever down uh, they said hey if you just texted me or came up to me and said hey if you ever need anything I'll be here I mean I think every single one of my teammates uh, came and has said that to me at some point of the journey and then it all starts talked about coach Dom it all starts with him I mean he talk about how great great of a guy he is I wouldn't be here today without him Kyle does have the opportunity to play another season of baseball at Mount Mercy University but he hasn't made a decision just yet whatever he decides he still wants to be around the game in some way throughout my the rest of my whether I play next year or not uh, I want to finish strong I want to perform strong you know my dad always talked about how baseball wasn't going to be easy but um, you kind of got to overcome that adversity and be mentally strong um, and then yeah I also hope to one day keep coaching um, I don't, I don't want to step away from baseball I love it so much so I'm not sure where I'll be or, or whatnot but I want to continue to inspire the younger inspire the younger generation just kind of like my dad did and then kind of carry his legacy over through coaching because obviously it baseball is going to be over pretty soon so but I want to continue that through coaching most likely and no matter where life takes Kyle his dad will always have a presence on the Mount Mercy University baseball field.